Hi, I'm Marie Eldridge and I'm here in the Handy Quilter studio. I have a quilt on the little foot frame that I have almost completed quilting. So I have most of the quilt done and I'm going to show you how to manage your quilt when you have all of this done. Now there is the possibility if you have quilted your quilt and you can just twist it and it doesn't matter that the design that you've quilted isn't directional on, or that you can come back from the other end and meet up in the middle and make everything work. But if that doesn't work for you, this is how you can manage your quilt. So like I said, I have all of this quilted. I already put it on the frame and I can go from the piecing that's already here and I can line up on the bar. So I've lined up on this side. I've wrapped my quilt around this pull and I've tightened it on using these clamps. So now I like to just fold it up. So I'm just going to fold it that way, kind of fold it again. All right, now we'll just take the clamps. I'm just going to kind of put this up here and we have these that we can just put on the fabric itself. It's just that part of the quilt that I've already done. And I'm just putting that around there, tightening it up, just kind of holding it out of my way. Okay, and these little ones, you can also use those and just grab a little piece of quilt if you feel like you need that fabric um, taken care of a little better. So I have everything together. And again, I can just use these little ones if I feel like I need it. And now I have this space that I can just tighten. And if you feel like you need more clamps, there is this one. You can buy extra ones, but I feel like I can quilt everything. I can get over to this side and do my quilting. And then I can go over to this side and I can take care of that. So once I get all of this space quilted, then I will shift my quilt to the other side. I'm now at the end of the quilt. So I have everything quilted, I'm to the very edge. But as you can see right here, this is all the fabric that I have here. So not enough to go very far around the pole and I've just barely got enough to clamp it. So that's one of the things that you want to do is to make sure you have enough fabric. Because if I try to quilt this, that's as far forward as I can come. So I'm not able to quilt this little bit up here. So one thing that you can do if you have not given yourself enough is to just get an extra piece of fabric. And so what I have here is just this is maybe about nine inches wide, and I can just baste it along this side of the fabric, use it like a leader, and then that would be the fabric that I can clamp, so I'm able to move this up and able to quilt the rest of my quilt. So hopefully you remember to do a big backing.